Definitely operator needs to uh, look into machine learning and AI because uh, ever-growing complexity of the network is overwhelming and is blocking the growth of the business on top of telecommunication industry. So digital economy is relying very strongly on telecommunication networks and uh, operators need to cope with the increasing requirements for bandwidth, for uh, low latency network, for coverage. We are focusing on the uh, predictive maintenance and uh, efficient root cause and impact analysis. So there is a plenty of different applications of AI uh, for different industries and we are utilizing the knowledge of different people uh, to, to speed up the process of implementing this in our portfolio. The main challenges in the OSS area right now is to be able to rapidly uh, adjust OSS functions according to running technologies. So to respond in a timely manner, to support new services, and only those players will win, which, uh, which are well-defined architecture, well-defined framework. Currently, this is the good time about virtualization and 5G, and there's, I think that the current operators has reached the border of their uh, old lega legacy OSSs, which cannot support uh, new functions. And it's exactly the time to change their OSS to the new architecture, to microservice architecture. Now we are in the era where we need to really address customer needs directly by expanding their digital presence in various channels, by enabling them to react quickly on the market changes, by enabling them to offer personalized experience to all of their customers. So customer centric now has a slightly different meaning. We really need to address customer needs precisely. Our flexibility is one of the biggest assets there because we are keen to not only to configure the solution, to, to deliver the solution, to fill the gap that exists in a given area, but we're also uh, happy to, to improve our software, just to, to expand it to fit these business needs that exist behind the transformation project. And every day is bringing new challenges and new possibilities and we just need to have open eyes and, and find the proper solution for, for the existing problems.